If you've been watching my channel for a while, you know that I'm all about sustainable living and doing what I can when I can to be more sustainable in the products that I purchase and use in my day-to-day -day life. Which is why when I discovered a plant-based trash bags and snack bag or slash kitchen bag company i was immediately intrigued this is a company called hold on that recently launched in may so they are a newer company but they focus on plant-based trash bags and also like snack baggies and kitchen bags not only are they plant-based making them better for the environment since they are avoiding that plastic they also degrade so 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 much faster than regular plastic bags so basically i was super excited to try out this brand i've been testing them out for a while now this video is in partnership with the brand so huge shout out and thank you to hold on bags as always opinions are always honest and my own and my goal is to help you guys with the content that i create so i am going to be doing a full review letting you guys know about these what makes them different than plastic why using more sustainable bags is important and just going over all of the details about the these bags. Also make sure that you watch through the whole entire video because I do have a deal where you can get a free product with a code that I have that they gave me to offer you guys. So make sure that you watch this whole video. I will be giving that code at the end of the video and I will also put it in the description box below, but let's go ahead and get right into this. So first off, let's talk about the plastic waste problem. As you all probably know, plastic takes a long, long time to decompose if at all, which is why it is super awesome because these bags degrade really pretty fast it's actually kind of crazy but plastic can actually take hundreds and hundreds of years to break down and in addition to that when plastic decomposes it emits toxic gases which actually can contribute to climate change and another thing for everybody who loves animals which we should just care about the environment anyway even if you aren't a huge animal lover but i mean who's not a huge animal lover but anyway when plastic breaks down it turns into microplastics which are small shards of plastic and then these small shards of plastic can get ingested by animals and can really hurt wildlife also a third of the world's fish contains microplastics which travels up the food chain to other animals and even humans so that's kind of crazy so hopefully that kind of highlights the importance of why it is really really awesome if you are able to switch to more sustainable bags because it's just so much better for the environment the animals and us so now getting into the bags themselves so hold on bags are an all-new line of trash kitchen and storage bags that are made from compostable plant-based materials that are supposed to be heavy duty yet gentle on the earth their bags are supposed to be convenient strong and easy to use just as easy to use as your typical trash and storage bags but these break down cleanly and they have much less of an impact on our environment like i mentioned their bags are plant-based they also use non-toxic materials the materials that they use are completely compostable materials that are supposed to be durable and strong just like plastic but they break down in weeks rather than centuries so unlike regular plastic bags that can take hundreds of years to decompose these bags actually decompose in weeks which I think is just so cool. And this just could make such a huge impact because you think about the amount of trash bags that we use. Like I just think the think about the amount of bags that I go through in my home. Depends on like how big your family is and how much stuff you have to throw away. But so the amount of trash bags that we use just really adds up. And when you're using plastic, just think about the amount of plastic that you're just putting out there into the world. So if we can have bags that decompose in weeks rather than hundreds of years, that could just be a huge help for the environment. Also something that you might be wondering, and when I say it takes weeks to decompose, they're not just gonna decompose before you use them, so don't worry about that. They just take weeks to decompose after you actually do throw them away. So basically what happens is once they end up in a landfill and they are exposed to heat, air, and pressure, they will start to decompose, and they do this without emitting toxic gases. Something also about their materials, they use PBAT. It breaks down quickly without emitting methane gas or toxic residue. This material uses less crude oil and fossil fuel than traditional plastics during production. It also includes PLA, it's a plant-based material that is made from the sugars in cornstarch, cassava, or sugarcane. And PLA requires 65% less energy than traditional plastics in production and emits 68% less greenhouse gases as it decomposes. And then they also use cornstarch, which is a common household substance that bonds the elements in the material to produce a flexible, durable final product. And this is an organic material that breaks down quickly without emitting toxic gases. And they also use 
responsible and more sustainable packaging. They use responsibly sourced FSC certified boxes to package their products and they don't use any unnecessary paper packaging and they never use plastic, of course. So how to use these is super, super simple. You simply just replace these with your ordinary bags. You use it just the same as you would with your regular plastic bags. So this is the household staple set. They also have a variety of other sets that you can choose from. You can also purchase the products individually if you want. But what I have seen from looking at their website is that when you do get the sets, you do get a better value for your money. So it is cheaper if you do get sets rather than purchasing the products individually. So again, this is the house staple set. The household staple set includes all of the products that they sell. So this is just like a set where you get everything. This is the 13 gallon trash bags. So this comes with 40 bags. They have a drawstring. These are supposed to work really well for your typical trash can size. Now, as you can see from this little demonstration here, these bags are slightly tight fitting when I am putting them on my trash can, but I think I have a pretty large size trash can. I love it, but it is a larger size trash can. So I can still make this fit, but it is a little tight. Although honestly, even with my regular plastic trash bags that I was using before, that was a snug fit as well. So I feel like it's pretty similar and I can definitely still make it work. Sometimes it does rip a little when I put it onto my trash can, but Again, that's just because I feel like I have a pretty large trash can, but I can still make it work. It's not an issue. It doesn't rip an extreme amount where it's not usable anymore. I just use a trash bag like I regularly would and the drawstrings that this has makes it really easy to just tie up and then throw it away like you normally would. Then the four gallon bags, these are really good for smaller spaces like bathroom trash cans or office trash cans or just any small space trash cans. I find that these work perfectly in my little trash bin that I have in my bathroom. It works really, really well. Again, these are super easy to use. Just use like you would any other regular trash bag. These do not have a drawstring, but you can just tie it up easily and that works totally fine. I just have to be careful not to overfill it because these don't fit a super lot, but I think it fills the perfect amount for a smaller trash can. So then for their zip seal storage bags, it comes in two sizes. Their sizes are the same as major competitor sandwich and gallon size storage bags. And they have all the convenience of your regular Ziploc bag without the harmful chemicals and materials. So that was something that also stood out to me is because when you're thinking about snack baggies that you are putting your food in, I've been trying to avoid plastic in my like storage containers just because it's not as good for you. So it's nice knowing that the bags that you are storing your food in are not made with those harmful chemicals and materials. So you can pack snacks for your kids in these or store food in it without having to worry and you just have peace of mind knowing that they do not contain any harmful chemicals. So then the gallon size bag, these are just a larger size of their Ziploc bags and these are really great for storing food. I've been using them for storing larger amounts of food after making meals, for storing leftovers. I really like having both of the sizes so I kind of just have my bases covered for when I need to store food or pack food. Also for the zip seal bags, of course you can use them for food but you can also use it for other things. Just like you would with regular like snack baggies or Ziploc bags, you can use it for for a toiletry when you're traveling. You can use it for storing some medications. You use it like you would a regular Ziploc bag. It's just really nice knowing that these are gonna decompose much, much faster. And it's just helping to not contribute as much harm to the environment, which I personally just wanna be able to do when I can. So when comparing these to traditional plastic trash bags, the main thing that really just calls out to me and why it is important to me and just what I really like about these is of course, not using plastic and not having to worry about them emitting these toxic gases or harsh chemicals by switching to sustainable plant-based quickly decomposing trash bags and snack bags it means that you are removing plastic toxins from your home they are more environmentally friendly it's nice to know that i am doing my part to try to be better for the environment it's making it so that you have a more low waste kitchen and household and like i mentioned earlier you really just use them like regular bags both the trash bags and the zip seal bags, you just toss them out like you normally would. Also something to note is that their bags are 100% home compostable, but that does not mean that you have to compost to use them. Like I mentioned, you just use them like you regularly would use a trash bag or Ziploc bags. But if you do want to use them like a compost, you would just fill the hold on bags with compostable material only like food scraps, newspaper, cardboard, things like that. And then you just toss the bag into your compost pile or bin, and then you would just treat it as normal compost waste. And in a few weeks, the bag will break down. So this full Full set with all of these items retails for $49.99 and if you look at regular trash bag prices the prices I feel like have definitely been going up but trash bag prices can be 
pretty pricey. These are definitely more expensive than regular trash bags, but I feel like that's a really good deal when you're getting all four of these items and this should definitely last you a while and like i mentioned at the beginning of this video hold on it did provide me a code that i can provide for you guys if you do purchase the household staple set you guys can get a free pack of these sandwich bags with the code danny i will have that code in the description box below if you guys do want to check it out and i will have the hold on website linked in the description box below overall i am really happy with these i think that they are a great step to trying to be more sustainable i'm not perfect I mean, all we can do is our best, but I think that if you're trying to have a more sustainable home and just purchase more eco-friendly things and you just want to kind of try to do better at using things that are better for the environment, I think that this is a great step, a great thing to incorporate into your home. If that really stands out to you, I think that these are definitely worth looking into and trying. If you guys do have any questions about these, please let me know in the comment section below. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. If you did, please let me know by giving me a thumbs up. And if you do want to see even more content from me in the future, I would absolutely love it if you would go ahead and subscribe to my channel. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching and I hope to see you all for my next video.